Excessive heat warning between now and not giving up until sometime on Friday. Instead of all, it was, say, two thirds of the viewing region under this excessive heat warning, and now they've elevated the heat advisory that was north of 36 Highway. And so it does appear that all of this, all the way up to even South Dakota, still with the possibility of 100 plus heat index readings. And you can see why this area of high pressure now nestling its way farther to the south over portions of Oklahoma as well as Arkansas. That clockwise circulation is continuous, keeping things hot and steamy. That is going to keep those high temperatures between 93 and 100 degrees. Your heat index is between 100 and 112. Low temperatures tonight, not very low at all. 77 in Kansas City, 77 in Chillicothe as well. Olathe getting down to 77. That hour by hour is going to have it moving through the 70s very quickly. 91 by noon, 95 your high temperature. Feels like temperature on the max 100 degrees as we're heading into midweek. Not much relief in sight. Everybody in the 90s, the mid 90s of that, if not the uppers, starting to move in. And we're going to be very close to 100 degrees heading into the weekend. Future scan those, painting on those chances of rain showers, which really diminish. So pre dawn on Wednesday, a fairly dry note. Heading to Kauffman Stadium, this is the way the forecast is looking. It's going to be a steamy one out at the ballpark, 92 for the first pitch, 84 and humid for the ninth inning. Here's that seven day forecast, and temperatures really don't cool down significantly. 77 to 95 hot on Wednesday, 78 to 98 degrees on Thursday. By Friday, 99, but again, it'll feel like 110. Saturday, still pretty hot, 76 to 96 degrees. Here comes a slight break as we cool down to 91 on Sunday. Cool down, I say. 30% chance of showers and thunderstorms, 20% risk on Monday, 70 to 87, and about the same on Tuesday.